in the church days where we was all sit around and sang and shit. Y'all ain't feel the good and the bad. Y'all just it was all good with y'all. Motherfucker was just sitting there patting y'all on the head all day, telling y'all, y'all, you're beautiful. You're beautiful is true. That what happened to y'all. Hmm. I don't know. We some emotional motherfuckers now. <laughs> Cause I grew up, we used to go outside there. We try to be different. If motherfucker was over there wearing Jordans, motherfucker, we was over here wearing felines. And we'll rock them felines and made you think them bitches was better than Jordans. And tell you, nigga, y'all, that Jordans are weak as fuck. Even though we like Jordans. <laughs> but, but nigga, we ain't gonna tell you that. That weak ass Jordans. Nigga, we got the felines over here, motherfucker. Reebok, bitch. <laughs> That's how we were. We wasn't all that monkey see, monkey do. Everybody got the same damn shoe. I'm going to punch you in the mouth, shoot at you for the gray George. Goodness, more Christmas, boy. I don't understand what's going on. <laughs> Good googly moogly. Man, good googly moogly, man. What is going on? Did anybody know? I'm just asking. What's happening? What is happening? Look at the weak weasels they put in front of us. It's a simple, what I think is a very good solution to a lot of our problems is to educate our children and make the environments just as safe. What I need to look at the model and my questions are going to, one of my questions is going to be, hey, when you guys regentrify the neighborhood, right? Because there, there should be a floor plan and there should be a whole workup on what happens and how much money is spent towards policing and how much money is towards the infrastructure and all that. All of that has be has to be like written up in the plan. I would like to see said plans and I would like to say, hey, these are the plans we need. Do this in every black neighborhood. Right. So that way these black children can play hopscotch down the middle of the street, put some speed bumps in that motherfucker so people can't ride through fast, just like in the white neighborhoods. Uh, make sure you have policing on every corner so niggas know not to come outside shooting because, boy, every time y'all regentrify a neighborhood that niggas wasn't safe to walk down the road, when them shit zoos come out and them white folks get their sandals on and the sun come out, they get to walk down and ain't no problem. So is it that we need to just bring in some white people to the hood or something? What is it that make it safe for white people and it ain't safe for us? I'm just asking. But I just need to see the model of how you turn these worst neighborhoods for blacks into the great dog parks and the walking areas and the jogging spaces for white people. I just got to know. And if you could show us that and do that in every hood instead of telling us, we could do it and all this shouting and yelling and bullshitting you doing and nothing changed. Just do that in every neighborhood. Put the same education that you put in the higher tax neighborhoods like coding, uh, trades and research skills and taxes and all that other shit. Put that in the schools in the hood, too. And I think that'll solve a lot of the problem. Because a lot of the programs that people created was geared towards kids like me. So I know the shit hardly ever worked. Because you sent us home, motherfucker. <laughs> you sent us home, motherfucker. My home fucked up. My brother selling dope right out front. And motherfucker is going crazy outside. You sent me home. My foundation was weak. And you keep sending me out and get me educated. And then you're sending me back in the area that your education turns me into a little bit of a victim. Because now I'm trying to talk to people. That don't want to do no talking. That's what we say. I don't do no talking. And after, boy, look at here. When a nigga walk up on you and say, I don't do no talking in the hood, they ain't talking. Matter of fact, it ain't good to talk too much. I'm just saying. So your programs is not going to really work unless you're going to address the safety of the home. And how do I know that? No, nah, I didn't go to school and have a book I had to read. No, nah, I didn't. I, didn't mm -mm. Uh, I got the best teacher in the world. I lived it. <laughs> you can take me to all the counselors in the world. As long as you're sending me back into this, this environment, 
I'm going to have to do what I got to do. Just saying. <laughs>